Okay, so what's up, YouTube? Um, this is the YouTube intro chat. Say hello to YouTube, even though they can't see you right now. It is uh, 80 degrees, mostly cloudy, where I live. I did meet the Octopath music, so um, this would be YouTube legal. Um, so let's get into it. it. I assume... So I'm going to be doing them from this menu. So I, yeah, it's the same. Okay, so let's start pool one. Pool one, okay. Um, actually, give, give me one second, y'all. Give me one second. You guys are just going to see a black screen for a second, but do not, do not fear. Do not fear. Do not fear. Okay, okay, we're good now. We're good now. All right, we're good now. We're good. Okay, so pool one, we got big, let's, let's just. Look at the names that we recognize, okay? We got Big Day G, Lord Akuma, who I believe is a katana. Felina, Mustard. Limbo. Vigzo. Parsa. Okay. Sunio. Wow. Sunio's there. Okay. So, um. No, Scar, you need. I, it was only five minutes. I got to time you out for like another, like, uh. Whatever the whatever gives you. So I meant to double it. My bad. Alright, so the clear favorites here are like Sunio, Parsa, Big Day G, Big Zo. It's kinda it's kinda rough that um that Parsa and Big Zo play each other early. Um, because they have to play each other and then they have to play Sunio. Whereas Sunio, like, he has to play like Limbo Dog and like one of these people, but I don't think they're like really a threat to Sunio. Like I think Sunio makes it here pretty easily. Man, I need a water already, bro. <laughs> I'm not I'm not used to talking talking uh this much. So you are not in it? Yeah, I'm not in it. I'm not going. Damn, I need a water quick. Yeah, we're gonna get limbo versus Lambo most likely. Alright, so um Okay, so pool A eighteen um we're gonna say winner side is pretty easily big daddy g here upset potential with the kuman Baylina, but i mean i'm gonna i'm gonna say big daddy g right so what pool is it a18 18 winners big daddy g and and then who with the bot so parson and sunio is an interesting matchup so it's big zone sunio but i just feel like uh sunio i feel like beating sunio with like noob or katana that's a tall task so i'm gonna say sunio makes it out over here regardless of who he has to play and then in losers so um so in loser side i'm gonna say man i can't, why am i hitting all the wrong key keys all right, so um, so in loser side, so who who do we got out of Parson and Big Zo? I would say probably uh, probably Parson. Oh no, Zansoon's there. Zansoon's there, bro. This is a stacked little side right here. You got Zansoon, you got Big Zo, you got Parsa. This is a stacked little side. So where did they all drop? So Zansoon and Big Zo will play right here. Where does you go, loser of you? Right there. Where does loser of Y go? Opposite sides. Okay, so I'm gonna say that Zanzoon. Uh, that's uh that Zanzoon beats Big. Z no, I'm gonna say Big Zo beats Zanzoon, and then I'm gonna say the Parsa beats Big Zo. So in on losers, so four people make it out losers. So right here I got Baylina right here, and then right here I got Parsa. So loser side we got Baylina, Parsa. Big Zo, Zanzoon, and um, so let me make sure it's possible though. So U drops here, and then Y drops drops here. So yeah, that is possible. Okay, so that's my full predictions for this pool. You think Parsa got it over Sunio? Really? All right, so pool number two, we got Unjust, we got PL, we got Welly, 
We got Dark Jack. Isn't that that guy that coached like a million people? Oh, I don't know who Pac-Man is, but he's got that HCW tag, which... That's a pretty good clan, right? Uh, K-Dog, Killer King's not going. Honey Bee, VLJ. Um... Okay, so... This pool is pretty easy, winner side. Um... I'm gonna say... And now I know some of you might say, bro, VLJ, he's been winning all these EU tournaments. Um, and I think VLJ could beat Honeybee for sure. It's just like, I don't know, man. I feel like Honeybee's like motivated for this tournament. And I also feel like um, VLJ's first offline tournament at the biggest offline tournament versus Honeybee, who's literally been at like a billion events. You know what I'm saying? So it's just like, it's hard for me to sit here and be like, uh, you know, VLJ is going to beat Honeybee. I feel like if they played each other in an online first to 10, VLJ would win. If they played in a first to 10 online, VLJ would probably win. But I, I feel like this set right here, I feel like Honeybee is probably going to win. So, Yoda Bell Kukui. Um, Okay, so let's look at other noble names to try to determine who makes out in losers. Um, let's just say, like, so losers, let's just say VLJ, obviously. Uh, let's just say PL gets out. Let's just say, um, I don't know these players. I'm sorry, y'all. Let's just say Dark Jack, I guess. And let's say, um, uh, just nasty, I guess. I, I don't know. Sorry, sorry, I don't know these players. I don't mean to be disrespectful. I just. I don't know the players, you know. Um, no, actually, let's say that uh, Pac-Man makes it out. Because I feel like people with that tag, they at least play the game. You know? So, let's say Pac-Man makes it out, but... Man, I don't know, bro. <laughs> Alright, so let's go... Let's go... Sorry, sorry to be disrespectful to those players, but I just... You know, I just, I just don't know them. They could be amazing. They could be amazing. Well, I feel like Welly's not really a player, though. He's more like a, you know, community guy, content guy. I don't think he really, like, is there to, like, do anything, um, like, in the bracket. Which, if he is, then, you know, blow, feel free to blow me up. Feel free to blow me up. All right, so uh, next pool. So we got K7. We got uh, Rockin' Polos. Liu Kang Kick Game. Who is that? Who is this? I feel like that name is familiar. Oh, so Just, Just Nasty has actually been beating people? Let me look at Just Nasty. Oh, so, yeah, this... Okay, so let me predict that Just Nasty gets out. Over, um... Over, over Pac-Man. I, I don't know who Pac-Man is, I'm sorry. The Just Nasty. We'll say Just Nasty gets out of there. Okay, so... Okay, so we got Show Off, we got Size Off. Butter Punch and Size Off, I believe those are both decent Cetrions. Uh, Killer Zhenok, Dylock. Um, okay, so MF Maria, isn't that like Slayer's like fiance? All right, so what pool is this? A A twenty eight. All right, so pretty easy in winners. Uh, we got uh, ooh, actually no, it's not really pretty easy in winners. Because you got Sizoth and K7. Um because Sizoth is like is pretty good, right? Yeah, Sizoth is like pretty good. But does he beat K7? I would say probably not. I would say probably not. Um, I'm going to say Scythoth 
Oh, man, I don't know. I'm going to say K7 in winners. K7 in winners. I know he doesn't play the game much, but he plays Sub-Zero. Like, come on, guys. Like, he plays Sub-Zero. Like, come on, bro. All right, so loser size off. Um, Butter Punch. Um, Dialogue. And who else? Just for the culture, we'll say MF Maria. <laughs> even though she probably doesn't even know how to do a combo. <laughs> okay, oh, 7 is DQing. Okay, bet. So let's sub in size off there. And then we'll say in losers, we will say. I'll just say rock and polos for the culture, but. Probably not, <laughs> but I'll I'll just say that dialogue. Um, man, I just don't know to me these players, bro. I'll just say Haitian King, but I mean I don't know, bro. And then I'll just say MF Marie. <laughs> Fuck it, I don't know a lot of these players. I'm sorry, guys. All right, so a twenty nine. Um, winners. Okay, we got Kerbo, we got Aztec, we got... We got Jensen, who isn't Jensen, like, a pretty good Scarlet. We got Manny. We got Rio. Kill a Cam. I mean, this is an easy pull. Just, unless there's someone secret in here. Katana Prime's in there. Um, okay, so Kerbo, Licious... And Aztec. Okay, so losers, we will go with Katana Prime. Um, Rio. And then Manny. I've got a Manny. And uh, Kill Cam. Okay. All right, so VG Vice pool. Okay, so what's the pool name? A38. Okay. A38. Winners. All right, so pretty clear that VGY gets out here in winners. And then on this side, we got. Is Herusium actually going? VGY isn't going, apparently. Okay. This pool is so free, then. I guess Sweat makes it out? I guess Sweat makes it out, winners? And then, over there, I guess... Oh, man, I don't know. I guess... <sighs> I guess, uh... I guess Blackout makes it out, winners? Man, I don't know. This pool is free since VGY is not going, bro. All right, so in in losers will say like um, I don't even know who these people are. Like I'm I'm sorry this this I'm bad at predictions. I don't know who these people are, bro. Zentai, Herusium is Herusium going? And then we'll say Dijon for the culture because I like Dijon, but I don't know if he's even playing. I don't know if he's just going to ruin the twins or if he's actually playing. Um, okay, so, 39. That's the thing about Evo, there's a lot of fluff in there. Like, a lot of people go just to go, so, like, from, like, a competitive point of view, you won't recognize a lot of people. There could be hidden killers, too, though. So, I'm not saying they're gonna be bad. Alright, so, oh, man, so we got Rewind, we got Shadow X, we got Boogie, we got, oh, my boy, Big Boy, he doesn't really play the game, though. Um, we got Shinny, we got... Omega Fatty. No, I don't know that. It's like, bro, this is the most stacked pool so far. This Blackberry, this is the most stacked pool so far easily. Like, someone good might drown in here. Whoa, this is crazy. All right, so Rewind for sure. And then, oh, man, Shinny versus Lanky. Ooh, I feel like Shinny's better at the game than Lanky. 
But I feel like they're both really good. So I'm going to go with Shinny, but there's upset potential there for sure. For sure. Okay, so looter side, well, we got Shadow X. And we got... um. No, I, no, actually... No, I think they're, they'll both make it out, so it doesn't matter. Um, okay, so Lanky. I see Boogie. And then where does... Where does Loser of X fall, and where does Loser of O fall? Loser of... Am I blind? Where are they? Loser of O. No, where does Loser of X... Right there. So one of them is going to drown. The Loser of Blackberry and Lanky, and the Loser of Shadow X and Boogie are going to drown. Wow. Damn. Um I'm gonna say I'm gonna say Boogie drowns. I'm gonna say that Blackberry gets the win there. But I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. That's tough. This is a tough pull. This is a tough pull right here. So the loser of Shadow X and Boogie and the loser of Lanky and Blackberry has to drown. That's the way it's 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 shaped out. The loser that has to. Like they have no choice. One of them has to drown. Alright, Scar, you're you're getting another. I don't know why you keep testing me like this, bro. Alright, so. Huh, this pool is tough, man. I'm going to say, I'm going to say Blackberry and it's hard to, hard to, let's, let's do projections. See, Boogie won't actually be on the side. Because they have him losing to, uh... Or wait, yay! Wait, I didn't... I looked at the brackets wrong, y'all. I thought this would go here. I thought this would go here. But this goes here. So where does... Where is V? Where is V? Yeah, so... Never mind, I'm, I'm being a dumbass, y'all. I'm being a dumbass. Alright, let's move on. Um, okay, so Arn, Arn will make it out in winners, and then who's on this side? Jukes and Pure? What kind of demon? What kind of demon path? Man, that could go either way, yo. That could go either way, Jukes and Pure? That is... That is crazy. Guy exceptional is top two in Brazil. Upsets are coming. Yeah, but you think he'll be Kratos, though? Like, I got him making it out, but... I don't know. I don't think he'll be Kratos. Um, okay, so I'm going to say Jukes. Man, this is a... Oh, man. All right, so Pure and, and Guy exceptional and Losers. Man, this pool is stacked, too. What the heck? These pools are starting to get nasty. And then we'll say like Faded Sal and um Man, I don't even know. <laughs> um Man, I, <laughs> we'll say Guamo makes it out, I guess. I I don't know. Sorry y'all. Yo, it's good player. Sorry if I'm not saying what's up to everyone. Um, I'm just you know, locked in on trying to, trying to predict. All right, so Foxy's pool. All right, so a forty nine winners. Okay, so I don't know who Foxy is playing at this event, like character wise, but I think this pool is really easy. 
So we're going to say Foxy. And then bottom side. Ooh, Jet Ring and J Chan. Ooh. Damn, Jet Ring and J Chan? Oh man, that's a that's a match right there in pools. That is a that's a ooh, that's spicy. That's spicy. Oh man. See, I feel like I like J Chan, bro. Like I like J Chan a lot, but I don't know, man. Um, I'm gonna go J Chan. I'm gonna go J Chan. I'm gonna go J Chan. All right, so losers, we got obviously Jet Ring. We got, I don't even know who to say on the other side, to be honest. I guess I'll go my boy El Chicote, but I don't even know if he plays the game at all. And then I guess Hasashi and uh, Unforsaken. Okay. All right, next pool. I think this is my boy Gambler's pool. No, it's not. Where, where's Gambler's pool? All right, so what pool is this? C18? Winners? See, they unseated Tekken Master because he's not going. So if you come in, you're like, why don't you have Tekken Master winning? It's because he's not going. Um... Okay, so Han, Han Rashid, and on this side, is Damister going? Wait, is Damister actually going? If Damister is going, then Damister is winning that bull. Damister's not going? Okay, so we got Forever King then. All right, so in losers, losers we got. Um, I I got Salisbury Torso making it. Um, I don't know anybody right here. I guess uh, Heisenberg. I like the game. Or we'll go with we'll go with a uh, Salt Shaker. Yo, Trill, thank you for the follow. I swear you followed before, though. Did you unfollow me? Do you not like me? Ooh, SBO's, SBO's pretty good this game, I think. So, SBO. And then we got, like, Vera. and I'll just say Vera makes it out. I don't know. <laughs> okay, next pool. Alright, so... C19. C19 winners. Um, Nicholas, I don't care who he is to play against. <laughs> um, and then on this other side, we got Pop Tart and Pulse and Ghost. Ooh, this is a stacked card. Page two player. Who is this? Is this Chico? Wait, he I, I beat him 3-2. Who is this? <laughs> who Who did I beat 3-2? Who is this? Oh, it is Chico. Okay. What the heck? <laughs> all right. Um All right, so on this side, Pop Tart or Pulse. Oh man, or Ghost. Ghost is in there. Oh man. I like Pulse. I like Pulse and Winners, man. I like Pulse and Winners. I like Pulse and Winners. All right, so Losers, we got... Man, I keep hitting the wrong keys. In Losers, we got um, Pop-Tart, uh, Ghost. Um, Zesquil, for sure. Zesquil, for sure, makes it to at least Nicholas. And then, I don't know... I guess, just Dave... Are there any... Oh, Zeus is in here. Wait, Zeus is in here. 
Wait, Zeus is not going? Oh, man. That would have been crazy if he was going. Wait, but who is... I guess we'll say Tinto makes it out. Does Tinto really play the game, though? I'll just say Chico makes it out. <laughs> I'll just say Chico makes it out, I guess. I don't know, man. Tinto solid enough. Okay, we'll we'll say Tinto makes it out then. Okay. So uh C28. That sucks Zeus isn't going. Oh, we got Waz's bull. Okay, so C28. Winners. We got Slayer and Waz. Ooh, that's a chaotic set right there. Um, I don't know who would win between Slayer and Waz. <laughs> Slayer could win that. I know, like, all the Waz fans are probably seeing this and they're like, what? What are you talking about? But Slayer could win that, bro. <laughs> Slayer, Slayer could win that. <laughs> like, no joke. I, I like Slayer to win that, man. Like, I'm sorry if y'all are, like, Waz fans and stuff. I like Slayer to win that. Um, <laughs> Are right, Luddy and Cusco, Shaolin's in there. Ooh, Shaolin's in there. Ooh. I still like Luddy, though. I still like Luddy. All right, loser side, I like, obviously, Waz. I like uh, Shaolin. I like... Uh, I like Cusco. And I like... Uh, I reckless, I guess. I don't know. Okay, so next pool C29. Yeah, I think Cusco makes it out in losers. Um so C29. So Sonic was playing last night and has been playing a bit, so I'm gonna make these predictions assuming that Sonic is playing. So I know that uh Ava is not. So Sonic, Ava and Pop Cap are not going. So the only people that could even offer a little bit of resistance against Sonic are not going. So Sonic out winners easily. Um, too easy and wise. NRS player, what the hell? Who is this? Who? Alex Dubé, isn't that Hayate? Yeah, this is Hayate. What? Alex Dubé is Hayate. Damn, he sucks at Tekken. What the heck? I've never even seen a placement that bad. I've never even seen a placement that bad. In my life. Yeah, this is Hayate. Yeah. Oh, he's not going to Evo? Okay. Alright, so we got Wise on the other side. Wise Gemini. Two sides to him. And losers, we got Too Easy. Ava and Papa Cap are not going, so... is After that, it's kind of slim pickings. I guess... This guy's the only one with the clan tag, so I'm going to say he makes it out. <laughs> I don't know. If I don't know someone, if and someone's nasty, tell me, y'all. All right, we'll say Illy Silly gets out. Trill, are you, Trill, you're in my chat. Are you good at the game? Or are you just going just, just to chill and vibe and whatever? Oh, Trill, you're not good? Okay. Then I'm going to say Tyrant gets out. I'm going to say that. 
I'm going to say that Naruto gets out and becomes Hokage. Oh, that's already four, so Naruto doesn't get out. Naruto drowns. Needs another arc or two. <laughs> Alright, C38. Uh, winners. Alright, so we got Kaiser, Conqueror, Fierce, Curious George, uh, Molly. Super Saiyan God, that guy's good. That guy is good. Super Saiyan God, if it's the guy that I'm thinking about, this guy is good. This is like all him losing. But he's good, though. He's good. Um, yeah, this guy's pretty good. So, I'm going to say, is El Kukui going? I'm going to say Conqueror. And Winners. And El Kukui. El Kukui. Yosubwaz. And then Losers, we got... We got Fierce. We got... Super Saiyan God. We got... I would say Infinity. And then I would say like... I, <laughs> Xavier, who's that? Who is Xavier? Uh, we're just going to say Rossi, I guess. Okay, so next pool. 39. C39 winners. Um. So we got Deoxys, Joystick, Zork. I like Joystick to beat Deoxys. And then I like, um, oh man, Scar and Scar. Who does Azteca play? Because I know that's not Aztec, but I'm pretty sure Aztec is also a decent player. Um, I like... This This pool is New Age versus... This, this pool is Old Guard versus New. Because we got Deoxys versus Joystick. And then we got Scar versus Scar. This, is, this, this pool is really New Age versus Old. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, um, but here's the thing though, Scar with the C has been grinding, bro. If he says he hasn't been grinding, it's just, it's the Red Dead 2 OS all over again. Because literally every time he streams, he's playing like a first to death versus like Jukes, Kebo, or like whoever. And then I'll be looking in that Kebo Discord, and it'll always be him with the, with the stream up playing somebody. You know what I mean? So it's like, he's been grinding, bro. If he says he hasn't. That, that is Cap. That's what the kids call Cap. You know what I'm saying? So, he has been playing a lot. Probably more than uh, most people. Because <laughs> uh, most people don't run, like, first to deaths like that versus, like, top players. So, uh... Yeah, back on Injustice 2, Scar with the C would be like, Oh, I don't play Injustice 2, I just play Red Dead. But then when you would check his player card, he literally had top two hours on PSN on Injustice 2. So, it's like... You know, we're not unfamiliar with the OSs. Isn't Scythe... Scythe is good, though. Scythe? But Scar with the C will beat him. So I, I got Scar with the K, though. I got Scar with the K in winners. In losers, I got... I got Scar with the C. I got Scythe. Scythe Shock. I got Deoxys. And I got... Wait, hold on, though. Where does... No, no I, that's what I do got. So, um, and then I got Zork. That's pretty easy pull to, there's no one like, there's enough people I know. Yeah, Zyth is good. I played him a lot on Xbox. But I think he'll lose to uh, Scar at the Sea. 
Dio mopping joystick? I disagree, but we'll see. That that's why they got to play. You know, doesn't matter what we think; it matters what transpires on the screen. All right, so C forty eight, C forty eight winners. All right, so yeah. <laughs> um. Oh man, Victor Freeze and Euphoring. That's a uh, that's a good little set right there. Who is Toby? Okay. I'm gonna say the Victor Freeze. Oh man, I don't know, man. That's a hard set right there. Euphoring and Victor Freeze. That's a tough set. Oh, man. I don't know. I'm going to say Euphoring, but I don't know, man. Victor Freeze could beat him. Okay, so losers, Victor Freeze. Victor Freeze. Lay, I like Leyenda. I like Leyenda to make it out. And losers. Uh, who is Reckless? I'll say they make it out too. Reckless makes it out and losers too. And then... Um, uh... <laughs> um... You know, y'all are right. Y'all are right. Get my boy Victor Freeze up there in winners. <laughs> Get my boy Victor Freeze up there in winners, bro. All right, so. All right, so who is. I guess we'll go with Quad Stack. Making it out. Who is J. George? Man, this pool is confusing me, bro. Alright, so I think this is the last pool, right? Hell yeah! You already know what time it is, bro. You already know what time it is. Call it bias, but I don't care. King Gambler. I don't even care who he is to play. I don't care. I don't care about nobody over here. Alright, so, and then, um... We got Woozy and Patient Impulse. That's a tough little set. But I feel like Woozy is, like, just amazing, you know? Like, I don't know. They're both amazing, but I like Woozy. Take that. And then Losers, I like, uh... I'll say Destroyer. And Impulse. And... I don't know who a lot of these people are. I know, I know some of them, like Game Easy, Zen Furby... LSD. I, I know like some of the names, but I don't know if they really play. I'm gonna say game time. And I guess Tolkien? I don't know, man. <laughs> Alright, so now top top 96. Alright, so F18. Alright, so. Let's do these predictions. These are not my predictions. These are just projected. So I know who's in what pool. So top 96. Top 96. F18. Make it out in winners. Make it out in winners. I have... So are these all the people I predicted? No, I had Pop-Tart losing. So I had Pop-Tart losing. Which, where was that pool? That was pool C19. That was pool C19, right? I had pulse. Okay. So in winner's side, Big Day G versus Sunio. I like Sunio. I had both of them making it, right? Yeah. So Big Day G versus Sunio. I like Sunio to make it there. And then Han versus Damister. He's not going, though. So where's C18 at? Yeah, so I had Han and Forever King. Yeah. So, 
Get some ghosts. So... I'm gonna say... I'm gonna say Han. Ooh, ah, man. It's gonna be either Sunio or Han. It's gonna be either Sunio or Han, in my opinion. And so I like either, um... Um... I'm going to go with Han, man. I'm going to go with Han in winners. And then on this side, dang, we got Unjust, Honeybee, Nicholas, and that'll be Pulse right there in my bracket. Um, So I like Nicholas to beat Pulse. I like uh, Unjust to beat B. Um, Unjust versus Nicholas. Here's the thing. You guys might say, oh, he beat Unjust already, CEO. You go back and watch that set. That was not an easy set for Nicholas. And you got to keep in mind, back then, people did not know him. You know what I mean? And now when people play him, they're going to have that, oh, shit, I'm playing like a Sonic Fox Ninja Killer type player. Like, kind of like, focus, you know what I mean? So, like, I don't know, bro. That's a tough set. That's a tough set right there. Nicholas has a hard path out of pools, bro. He's got Pulse and then Unjust? Or Pop-Tart, even, if Pop-Tart beats Pulse? Damn, so I like, um, who, I don't know, man. I like Nicholas, I like Nicholas, but Unjust could win, Unjust could win. I feel like I should pick Unjust for, like, America Pride, but I don't have America Pride, so I don't have American Pride, so <laughs> I'm just going with my brain. I think Nicholas will win, but I think Unjust can take it. So in losers, I got Sunio and Unjust. And then who will make it out down here? So we got Scarlet. Okay, so based off my bracket, this will actually be Deoxys and and Scar with a C coming out of here, right? Because let, let's go back and see that bracket. Where do they have Joystick losing? They have Joystick making it here. Okay, so this will be Deoxys and Scar with a C playing right here. Which, at that point, I have Scar with the C beating Deoxys. I have Deoxys losing right here. And then he'll make it to play... Ooh. He'll make it to play either Lanky or Big Daddy G or Shadow X. Ooh, this is a stacked little portion. So we got Scar with the C making it right here. Or wait, no, 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 no. Han, because we got Han playing... um. Forever King. Okay, so I got Scar with the C beating Forever King. I got Scar with the C beating Forever King right here. I know this will get confusing because the project projections are way different than how I have it. But I got Scar with the C beating Forever King. Damister, he's a Russian player, but he's not going. He's not going. Um, Scar with the C beating Forever King right here to get here. Scar with the C right there. And then we're going to have Big Daddy G versus either Lanky Shadow X. Okay, so I'm going to say Lanky gets here versus Big Daddy G, and Lanky beats Big Daddy G. And then we got Scar with the C versus Lanky, which at that point... Oh, which at that point... I like Lanky, man. I like Lanky to beat Scar with the C. I like Scar with the C to go out at 25th. And then down here we got... um, We would have Honeybee... And and Pulse, which I think they would be anyone out of these paths, Honeybee and Pulse. So they would be Pulse and Honeybee, which at that point, I like Honeybee, man. I like Honeybee to make it out there over uh, over Pulse. I like, I like Honeybee, bro. Alright, so what's the next one? F19, okay. This is getting a little more complicated to predict since the projected is a bit different than what I'm saying, but we're trying, y'all. All right, so F19 winners. Who did we have in A28? We had Sizoth and Killer Zhinnok, which at that point I have Killer Zhinnok. We had Slayer and Luddy. So it's going to be Slayer versus Luddy and Killer Zhinnok versus Sizoth. 
So I think it's going to end up being Sizoth versus Killer Shinnok. Or no, no, it's going to... It's my brain, bro. I think it's going to end up being Killer Shinnok versus Luddy. I think Luddy will beat Slayer. So at that point... Killer Shinnok versus Luddy. I like Luddy. I like Luddy to win that. Um, Y'all might disagree, but I like Luddy to win that and make it out there. Um, on this side, we got Sonic versus Wise, and then we got Kerbo versus Aztec. I like Aztec, or I like Kerbo to win that, and then I like Wise to beat Sonic. If Sonic's playing, but here's the thing, if Sonic's not playing, Wise is going to make it through pretty easy too. So I like Wise. I like it to be Wise and Kerbo here. And then I like, ooh, man. I don't know. I don't know who I like out of Wise and Kerbo. Because I feel like Wise is a better player, but I feel like that matchup is a little tricky for Liu Kang. Like uh, Cabal. I feel like that matchup's a little tricky for uh, for Cabal there. Man, I like Wise to do well at this tourney, though, bro. Like, I just, I feel like he's going to come in hot. So I'm going to say wise. I'm going to say wise. And then in losers, we're going to say, um, so Slayer will drop here. Sizoth will drop here. Um, did we have Jet Ring making out winners? Or, or J-Chan? J-Chan, J right? What pool was that? A A49? Yeah, we had J Chan. So this will be Jet Ring here. This will be Jet Ring. Playing Sizoth. I like Jet Ring to beat Sizoth. I like uh Slayer to beat Patient Impulse. So at that point we would have J Chan versus Slayer? Which at that point, bro, I like Slayer, man. <laughs> I like Slayer to to win that. I don't know. I don't know why. I just I just feel like Slayer is gonna do good. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why. I think he loses the Luddy, but I feel like he beats he beats Patient Impulse and J Cham, bro. <laughs> I feel like Slayer makes the top forty two losers. I don't know why. I just do. <laughs> All right, so we got Aztec dropping down here. Ooh, we got the loser up here. Bro, this is a stack pass. So we got the loser up here in Jukes drop in there. We got the loser of uh, Scorpion Prox and Guy Exceptional drop in there. Man, that's rough. I like I like Pure. Ooh, who, Guy Exceptional though, bro. Guy Exceptional though, bro. Oh, man. Oh man. Let's let's do more research. Let's do more research on guy exceptional. Okay, so boom. Man, I feel like this guy's really good, bro. I know it's saying he's losing there, but see, first, first, third. Um... Man, I don't know, bro. Damn, bro. I don't know. Look at pool A19. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to say guy exceptional and losers. We'll say guy exceptional and losers. Spell his name wrong, my bad. Alright, so let's look at the other... What's the next one? Uh, F38. Okay. 
F38, which is going to be a lot different than it looks because my predictions are not what they said. Okay, so winners. BGY DQ'd. So who do we have making it out? Sweat MD and Blackout. Um. And then Conqueror and El Kikui, that we did predict that. Whoever wins out of these two is making it through there. So. I'm going to say that, uh, that Kyle beats Conqueror and makes it out in winners. And then I'm going to say that. Um, so this is Rewind. Versus, bro, Rewind's path is fucked up because it's going to be Rewind versus Shinny. And then he's going to have to, based on my predictions, he's going to have to play the winner of Scar with the K and Joystick. Bro, that is fucked. Oh, man. Oh, man, that's tough. Yosef Charbok. I like Rewind to beat Shinny. And then, oh man, I'm not going to lie. I like Rewind to beat Scar with the K. I'm not going to lie. Um, I like Scar with the K to beat Joystick, and then I like Rewind to beat Scar with the K. Um, so yeah, we're going to say Rewind. And then in Losers, I'm going to say... Uh... Damn, so Conqueror will drop down to play Pop-Tart. And then... There's VLJ down there too, bro. These paths are nasty. They're getting nasty, bro. These paths are getting nasty. So we're gonna have VLJ, and then we're gonna have Conqueror. Based on my predictions, Conqueror and Pop Tart. I like Pop Tart. I like Pop Tart to win there against Conqueror. I know it's probably gonna upset like the League of Latina fans, but I do have Conqueror going out thirty third. Um. So we'd have Pop-Tart versus VLJ at that point, and at that point, I like Pop-Tart. I like Pop-Tart, bro. I like Pop-Tart to make it out. Um, And then, who else? Okay, so... Well, obviously, we would have to pick someone up here, so I would say that, like... I guess... uh, I guess Blackout? <laughs> I don't know. I guess Blackout makes it. Yeah, I guess Blackout makes it up there, so Blackout. And then Scar with the K, obviously. And then Pop-Tart, and then... Okay, so... Tekken Master's not going, by the way. So if you see Tekken Master there, and you're like, why aren't you predicting him? He's not going. Okay, so... Uh, we got Shinny, who I predict he'll drop down there. And then we got... Um... We got Joystick. Joystick and Shinny. Whoa. Joystick and Shinny, that is a, uh, and Forever King won't be here in my bracket. So we got Joystick versus Shinny. Oh man, how good is, how good is Joystick against Shinny though? Or against, uh, Cetrion? Yoda mashup. I'm gonna I'm gonna go with Shinny, y'all. I mean I feel like Joystick could win, but I'm gonna go with Shinny. Alright, so okay, so man, this is stacked right here. This is stacked. Alright, so F39. 39 winners. Wait, hold on though. Hold on though. Let me go back to F19. There's something I missed. There's something I missed in F19. Because I would have Wise beating Sonic right here, so where would Sonic go? Sonic would go right here. Oh, I like I like Sonic to beat whoever is here. Whether it be Guy Exceptional or whoever. Yeah, so... Sorry to all the Brazilian fans, but... Yeah, I like Sonic to be there. If Sonic's not playing though, guy exceptional, sure. Sure thing. But
Um, okay, so we got Arm versus Jukes. We got Scorpion Procs versus... Ooh. Okay, so I like Jukes to beat Kratos. I like Scorpion Procs to beat Jukes. That's where I'm at. That's where my head's at with that. I like Jukes to beat Kratos. I like Scorpion Procs to beat Jukes. That's where my head's at. And then on this side... I, I honestly think Gambler will beat all these players. You know, if you want to disagree, that's fine. If you want to say I'm biased, that's fine. That's fine. Go ahead. All right, so loser side. I do like Foxy to be either J-Chan or Jet Ring. So we'll say Foxy right there. We'll say uh, Jukes. And then where, was, where would Kratos drop down? Kratos would drop down right here and play like... This would be Forever King. In, or no, this would be... Uh, Wait, who? Oh, no, this would be too easy. This would be too easy in the real bracket. So too easy versus Victor Freeze. And then we got Kratos. I like Kratos to be either of them, like, honestly. And then we got Woozy versus probably J-Chan or Dylock. Or no, Waz will be there. Waz. Waz will be there. I like Woozy to beat Waz, though. I know y'all love Waz, but... I like Woozy to beat Waz. And then we'll have J-Chan versus Woozy. Which, at that point, I like Woozy. I like Woozy, man. I like Woozy to make it out. Alright, so that's all of Top 96 predicted. Let's move on to Top 24. Alright, so Big Daddy G versus Nicholas. That is not... Um, I have Han versus Nicholas. So let's... Okay, top 24. Predictions. Um, Who do we have making top eight? Okay, so... Who do we have making top eight winners? I have... I like... I like Nicholas versus Han. I like Nicholas versus Han. And I, I like... So who would end up here? Luddy and Wise. Luddy and Wise. I like Luddy, man. I don't know why I got Luddy making it so deep. I don't know why I like Luddy making it so deep. Watch Luddy like not even make top 96 or something. I like Luddy, man. I like Luddy to, to make it, bro. I don't know why. I don't know why. I just do. <laughs> All right, so El Kikui and Rewind. I like Rewind to, to be El Kikui. I love El Kikui, but I like Rewind. And then Scorpion Prox and Gambler. You already know what time it is now. Um, so let's really think about this set. So if you go back and watch Gambler versus Nicholas at CEO, Gambler blew, wasted two games on Nightwolf. And then when he switched to Sub-Zero, it was literally like they were like on an even playing field. It's just Nicholas clutched out a third game to win. Like, Gambler won a game, and then Nicholas, like, clutched out game four to win. But I think Gambler, like, if he's playing amazing, is, like, on the same level as these guys, to be honest. But I just, I feel like they're they're a little bit better than him, bro. And I feel like they're a little bit more knowledgeable of the game. So I I hate to do it, but I got Scorpion Prox sending my boy Gambler to losers. Um, all right, so loser side... Uh, loser side, okay, so coming out of F39, who do we got in losers? See, this is going to get confusing, though. Yeah, from here, it's going to get confusing, y'all. Yeah, I, I don't even know. No, I'm going to go with Wise. I'm going to go with Wise to beat Luddy, to be honest. I was just thinking about it a little bit more. Okay, but Losers is confusing as hell, though. It's because I don't know where these people are coming from. Um, so this would be Foxy. This would be Foxy, I think. Oh, this is just projected. These are my predictions. These are the projected. 
So gambler Foxy would be in Gambler's place in mine. And then who would be in Damister's? Lanky? So Lanky versus Foxy? Which at that point I like I like Lanky to get here. And then here it would be Hold on, let me go look at this bracket again. This is this is the hard part to predict because it's all mixed up. Like Alright, so this would be Jukes in my bracket. And then this would be let's open them all back up so we can know for sure where they'll be. Alright, so where is Honeybee coming out? All right, so who did I have making it out there? Honeybee. Okay, so Honeybee would be there in my bracket too against Jukes, which at that point I like Jukes to beat Honeybee. So it would be Jukes and Lanky, at which at that point I like Jukes to beat Lanky. And then which at that point it would be... Bloody and Jukes for top eight losers. Imagine that. That would be crazy. Bloody and Jukes for top eight losers, bro. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Bloody and Jukes, bro. Oh, man. I like Jukes, bro. I like Jukes to be Luddy. I like Luddy to get knife, bro. I hate to do it to my boy Luddy, but... Yeah. <laughs> All right, so who did I have beaten Scar with the C? To make it out, I forget. I had like uh, I forget. I'm trying to think of like how I had this bracket. Okay, so okay, so. Where's the bracket that... Okay, so this is the bracket I had Scar with the C. And then who did I have making it out of that? I had Lanky, right? Bro, this is confusing. So where was Deoxys? Where was Deoxys? And, uh... Or where was, uh, Joystick? Joystick. Okay, so Joystick is there. This is where I would have... Wait, hold on. My brain, bro. My brain is not... <laughs> this is... Bro, predicting top four, tw top 24 losers uh, based off, like, the... Because it's hard, right? Because there's not a number, like, the first loser of that portion or the second loser of that portion. You have to guess kind of where your predictions will fall. You see what I'm saying? So, like, where is the oxygen in their bracket? Okay. So, that's where I would have joystick. So, I would have... So, I would have... That, that would be Scar with a K in my bracket. I know it doesn't make a lot of sense, but Deoxys right here is Scar with a K in my bracket. All right, so where did they have Killer Zhinok? Okay, so I have Killer Zhinok losing right there to uh to to Luddy, right? Yeah, that's what I isn't that what I had it? Wait, what? I think I did these predictions all wrong, y'all. Yeah, I think I did them all wrong. There was, yeah, there were supposed to be two losers. That's where I messed up. That's where I messed up. So in this Luddy bracket, I should have had Zhinok and, uh, and Kerbo making it out too. Yeah, so there we go. Now it's now things make a little bit more sense. Okay. So yeah, so Zhinok, I have... Uh, who do I have making it out here in real life? I think I have Slayer, right? Yes, yeah, Slayer, Slayer, Slayer. So Scar with the K and Slayer. So this is in my bracket. This is Scar with the K and Slayer, which I have Scar with the K winning that. Okay, so Scar with the K is here now. All right, so Conquer and Aztec. Okay, so in in my bracket I have Sonic here, and I have where's Conqueror? I have. 
Um, I have Pulse. Or no, no, no. I have Pop-Tart, 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 Pop-Tart. So Pop-Tart and Sonic. Pop-Tart and Sonic right here. Pop-Tart and Sonic. You know what? Let's just make my whole top 24. Let's just make my whole top 24 so this isn't so freaking confusing. Okay, so... Winner's side. Or let's keep track of that loser side. So who did I have again? Man, <laughs> this is so hard, bro. Okay, so we'll just do winners first. Okay, winner side. Winner side, who did I have? Top 24. Bro, this is hard, bro. Winner, winner side. Because they don't have numbers. So it's hard, it's hard to predict. All right, so we had Nicholas versus Han. I'll just do it like this. Okay, Nicholas versus Han. And then we had... Who who is there again? Oh yeah, Luddy versus Wise Gemini. And then we had um who makes it out of the VGY path on my shit? El Kikui. Yeah, El Kikui. El Kikui versus Rewind. And then Scorpion Prox versus King Gambling. Okay, so losers now. Losers. Losers. Boom. Okay, so, on this side, it is now F93. So, where is Gambler in, in this? Okay, so I have Foxy there. So, Foxy versus... Where is Damister in this? And who do I have coming out of there? So, I have Lanky. Lanky. So, Foxy versus Lanky. Okay. And then who? Okay, so Kratos. So that's Jukes for me and Honeybee for me. Okay, we remember. Jukes versus Honeybee. And then Deoxys and Killer Jinox. So wasn't that? Yeah, it was Scar with the K versus Slayer. And then Sonic versus... Sonic Fox versus... Who, oh, Pop Tart, Pop Tart, Pop Tart, Pop Tart, Sonic Fox versus Pop Tart. Okay. And then down here, okay. So I have Kerbo. Where do I have Kerbo in real life? Okay, I have Kerbo losing there too. So Kerbo, Kerbo, Kubo, <laughs> Kerbo versus. Who do I have? I've conquered losing there, and then where do they have El Kikui? Oh, who do I wait? What? Oh, I'm dumb. I'm dumb. So who is who is there? Okay, so never mind. Sonic does not play Pop Tart. Pop Tart plays Kerbo. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and then who would who is is losing here in my real bracket? Because it's El Kikui versus who? Oh, Blackout. So we got Sonic versus Blackout. Okay. Okay, there we go. Wait, hold on. Wait, what? My brain, bro. Okay, so I, I have... In real life, I have... Who do I have here? So, 38. Sweat and D and Black... So, I got Blackout winning right there. So, yeah, it is Sonic versus Blackout. Yeah, okay. So, okay. This is confusing to do, y'all. This is why I didn't do it with CEO or Combo Breaker. But I'm trying to predict the whole tournament here. <laughs> Alright, so, yeah. So, Kerbo versus Pop-Tart. I think, right? <laughs> Wait, hold on. Okay, so... 38. Yeah, because I would have, have Pop-Tart there. Yeah. So, yeah, there we go. So, Kerbo versus Pop-Tart. 
Okay, so there we go. Okay, so K7. All right, so where did I have Scar with the C at? Or no, that would be Scar with the K at that point. <laughs> oh, man. Once we got these next three matches sorted, though, we we will it won't be confusing anymore. So, okay, so... <laughs> Where's K7? Okay, so that's like size. Of, okay, so this is Killer Jinnok. This is where Killer Jinnok will be. Okay. This is where Killer Jinnok will be. Okay. And then where is Scar with the C actually in the bracket? Okay, so this is where I had Joystick and, and Perfect Shinny, and I had Shinny out, right? Yeah. So Killer Shinnok versus Perfect Jenny. Okay. And then the last two matches unjust and where is unjust? Okay, and just is there in my bracket too. Okay, so that would be Kratos. Yeah, in my bracket that would be Kratos. So I had Kratos making it out, right? Yeah. So unjust versus Kratos. And then um F eighteen. Okay, so yeah, that's how it would end up in real life too, Han versus or no, it would be uh Big Dag G versus Woozy. See, this is where I messed up. This is I messed up with these first two portions because I didn't keep in mind that this person makes it out right away. I didn't keep that in mind. So where did I have Big Dag G dropping down? See, because Han makes it out, Nicholas makes it out, and then Justin and Big Dag G make it out. So what extra person did I have making it out? Or no, I had Sunio making it. Bro, my brain. My brain. This is hard to do, y'all. Okay, so I have Sunio making it there. Man, my brain is like, <laughs> it's not working well. Okay, so I have Sunio making it there. Okay. Okay, so I have Sunio making it there. Okay, so the bracket, no more confusion. We have it, we have it set. Okay. Okay. So this is, this is my top 24. This is Tweety's top 24. Okay. Okay, so let's set top eight. Top eight winners. Nicholas. Versus Wise Gemini, two sides to him all night. Rewind versus Scorpion Props. Loser side. Now this is where it gets a little confusing, but I like I like Lanky to beat Foxy. I like Jukes to beat Honeybee, and I like Jukes to beat uh, Lanky. Okay, so then who? Loser of B? Okay, so loser of B. So that means that Luddy vs. Jukes, which at that point, I like Jukes to make the top eight losers. Who will he be playing against, though? So we got Scar with the K. I got him beating Slayer. We got Sonic vs. Black Eye. I got Sonic winning. I got Scar beating Sonic. Sonic exiting the tournament at 13th. And who would Scar with the K play to make top eight? Scar with the K would play Han Rashid. Which at that point, I like Scar with the K to make top eight losers. And then Kerbo versus Pop Tart. I like I like Kerbo. Shinnok versus Shinny, I like Shinny. Um I like Shinny to beat Kerbo. 
I like Shinny to beat Kerbo. So who would Kerbo? Who would Shinny end up playing? Ooh, Gambler. So it would be Gambler versus Shinny for top eight losers. And you already know what time it is. I got my boy Gambler making top eight losers. <laughs> I mean, I have to. That's my dog, and I do believe he can do that. I do believe it. All right. So unjust versus Kratos. Um. Man. Man, I like Kratos to beat Unjust, man. I like I like Kratos to beat Unjust. And I like uh I like Woozy to beat Sunio, and then I like Woozy to beat Kratos. So who would who would Woozy play for top eight losers? It would be uh Rewind or Kukui, right? It's the Woozy versus Kukui for top eight. And then from and then there I like uh Oh man. I like El Kikui, bro. I like El Kikui to beat Woozy, make top eight losers. So this is my this is my top eight prediction. Boom. Let's predict all the top eight. Why not? And here's the thing. I'm predicting this whole bracket from round one. So like this bracket could be like halfway wrong. But all I'm saying is you do a full prediction bracket if you want to talk shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right. So so in top eight, in top eight, I got, I like, um, all right, let's just say top four. Let's just say top four. So in top four, so to get there, I like Nicholas to beat Wise. I like Rewind to beat Scorpion Prox. I like Rewind to beat Scorpion Prox this time. In Losers, in Losers, I like, um, I like Scar with the K to beat Jukes. I like Scar with the K to beat Jukes. I like, uh, I like Gambler to beat El Kikui, bro. I like Gambler. So who would they play? Who would they play? So, uh... Loser of B. So, it would be Scorpion Prox versus Scar. And then it would be Wise versus Gambler. Okay, so I like Gambler to beat... Or I like Wise to beat Gambler. I have my boy Gambler going out of fifth. I like Wise to beat Gambler. And then I like... Hmm... I like Scar with the K to beat Scorpion Prox. I like Scar with the K to beat Scorpion Prox. So this is my top four. This is my top four. My top four at Evo. Nicholas versus Rewind and winners. Scar versus Wise Gemini and losers. My top four at Evo. And then from there, I like Nicholas to beat Rewind. Okay, so this is how I got it. This is how I got it. First place, Nicholas, Evo champion. Second place, Rewind. Third place, Scar. Fourth, Wise Gemini. Fifth tie. Fifth would be tied at King Gambler and Scorpion Prox. Seventh place, Jukes and El Kaku. That is my full top eight prediction. Now, y'all might say, why are you predicting Nicholas to beat Rewind? I have no American pride. You know what I'm saying? I'm thinking with my brain. I feel like Nicholas is more focused than his brother. That's why I have Nicholas up here and Scorpion Prox getting upset. I, I think Nicholas is more focused than his brother. I feel like if you go from CEO to Combo Breaker, it went from Scorpion Prox kind of being the more alpha brother to a Combo Breaker. Scorpion Prox damn near lost every set he played. Like, damn near lost every set he played besides Gurr. And Nicholas was just clean in fucking house. Like, I feel like Nicholas is the more focused out of the brothers. So I like him to win. I like Rewind to get second. I like Rewind to close the door on Scar. Uh, to and double, or Who did I have sent in Scar to losers? Who did I have sent in Scar to losers? I don't even remember. All right, so where did I have...
Oh yeah, I had rewind. So yeah, rewind double eliminates him. Yeah, rewind double eliminates him. That's my prediction. So yeah, there's my full predictions, y'all. Uh, I tried to do the whole bracket. I know like a lot of this is gonna be end up. I literally predicted every match. So, <laughs> so like, and then the matches that would be made based off of every match I predicted. So all you guys who want to come in and be like, you were so wrong about your predictions. You got to do this yourself if you want to talk shit. You know what I mean? Because this shit was hard, bro. This shit was hard. You know what I'm saying? Who had the toughest competition between Nicholas and his brother at Combo Breaker? I think it was about even because, like, it's just Nicholas made him look so easy, you know? But Scorpion Prox probably had a, a tougher path. Yeah, if anyone wants to talk shit about these predictions after the fact, just keep in mind, you didn't do predictions. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, yeah, this is my full predictions. I got... Nicholas first, Rewind second, Scar third, Wise Gemini fourth, King Gambler and Scorpion Prox fifth, Jukes and El Kakui seventh. That's my full Evo predictions. You know, if it ends up being wrong, I tried, you know. Make some predictions, Cease. Make some predictions, bro. Wait, who do I have getting ninth in my bracket? Oh yeah, I have Woozy getting ninth. I have uh, Perfect Shinny getting ninth. I have who do I have getting ninth over here? I forget. Oh yeah, Han, Han. I have Han getting ninth. So I have Woozy, Shinny, Han, and Luddy. Woozy, Shinny, Han, and Luddy. Getting night. That's tough. So yeah, that's my full predictions, y'all. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I am gonna. Uh, I am gonna. Uh, my brain isn't working right now for some reason. I'm gonna end stream so that this vod doesn't take like a million years to download, and then I'm gonna be streaming again in like an hour. Uh, I'm gonna do my like ESL run or whatever. I think there's an the ESL. Um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. That's my full predictions. If you want to talk shit, just keep in mind, you didn't do a full prediction like this. You know what I'm saying? Like, this this was hard. But that's that's what I got. I got Nicholas in first, Rewind second, Scar third, Wise Gemini fourth, King Gambler and Scorpion Prox fifth, Jukes and El Kikui seventh. All right, later, y'all. I'll be back in like an hour.